Meister. They got dominated 3v4. Actually, they won that side. But when it was 4v4, it was not so fun for the YouTubers. No, it, it, the it, it Pounders, wasn't. Pounders going up against Termination, and we were told by Jaeger that he spells Jaeger Meister wrong because Jaeger is his last name. Congratulations, John Jaeger. We will watch you in your Remington here in Search and Destroy. That is a cool fact, and I would love that last name. I'm not going to lie. That would be an awesome last name. Yeah, it's a pretty good one. We can shrapnel the bomb carrier, trying to make his way to B, and he just lost Ronnie Ron the cover. Oh, my goodness. Termination inside the base as they flood through the motel. I'm looking all over, trying to see where the support is. Redneck did pull out that sniper, as I was hoping, and he's got a player top broken. Hits the shot. Hit markers as he hits the hip. Not high enough to get the one-shot kill. And now it's up to Jaeger. One on three. Two players in the motel, and he is simply going to be pinched. Gumby with your round ending kill cam. Gumby is just on fire. He's a man on a mission right now. You can just see the determination in the way he's playing. He is not going out now. He wants that qualification spot so badly. And fair, fair play to him. He's kept his head in the game. So many teams would have really freaked out after what happened that last last round but hey you know, these guys really are dominating and this search and destroy i have a feeling it if termination win this attacking round this may be a very very quick game of search termination gumby on your screen they are on the attack and he will find first blood up top motel now that bomb trying to move in and who's the player to watch it it's ronnie ron let's have a look at ronnie ron then he's the player that's most advanced on the defensive side and like the rush, he just nice. to his teammates. He's in a fantastic position, but can he try and capitalize from it? That's going to be the question. He sees the dead body, desperately trying to scout someone out. We can see it on that minimap, though. Someone is planting the bomb as we speak, so he's got himself into this great position, but hasn't really been able to do anything with it. There's one. Is he going to find the second? to the right. Oh, no, he's not going to be able to. Two versus two now. Gummy and Chaotic going up against Redneck and Jaeger. Let's go, Redneck. You reckon? You reckon he's going to go big? I... I want to see a close match here, and I think they need some early confidence here from the YouTubers. The Pounders need to go big and redneck. Oh. You know, by now he needs to learn the knife is stronger than any bullet. Denied. Oh, uh, that's 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 the two piece. Yeah, Chaotic says no, boys. This motel is mine, and that will do it. As Jaegermeister will be cleaned up here in our round ending kill cam. Yeah, nice plays there from Chaotic. Left in that one versus two situation. Yet to die still. 3-0. and oh, Really having a strong, strong start. And I, I, I said at the start of the round, I think if Chaotic win that... Um, sorry, if Termination win that attacking round, I think this may be very quick. Judging by the way they're playing, it, it, this this is just a great performance from them. You can still tell they have that hype. They have that momentum about them as, as now the pound is making their way towards that B-bomb site. And, you know, I expect to see some smoke grenades at least. I, I'm not too sure if any of them are running them though. You see Chaotic up top. I have the Oracle Vision on. Everyone below him. And I have Jaeger kind of lit up. He's on B right now. Wicked Shrapnel moving in to plant that bomb. Chaotic is the key player to stop this push. Someone is going to need to do something. Try and put a stop to it. I'm looking at Chaotic now. He's come behind. There's one. Nice pick. Can he find the second there in the middle of the map? Where is his teammate, though? That is the question explicit. In a nice position. They've got good cover, but this is what I don't like. From, from Redneck and Wicked, Wicked Trapnel. Look at the split between them, the gap between them. I mean, Wicked Trapnel's gone to plant A, which is a, a great move, but Redneck really should have gone with him and tried to help him out a little bit more because now if Wicked Trapnel's going to get taken out, which it looks like he may do, uh -oh. there is no one to cover that bomb. Redneck also caught reloading in the middle of the map. I think they... Can't do that. They, they've been watching pros. They know some good ideas. They just don't know how to execute it properly, and I think that's what we just saw there. But props to them so far, getting all the way to round five. They've just run into a team that is so good. Termination has Chaotic again, opening up perfect in Search and Destroy. 5-0 with a Diffuse now. Yeah, really, really strong stuff. And I, I, I think you're right. I think you know they, they have the right ideas, uh, and they know what they should be doing. It's just maybe uh, they haven't had time to practice the execution right. as much as they, they may have, have liked or have wanted to. Because, I mean, that rotation to A was perfect, but you can't do that by yourself. If you do that, both players need to go. Why? Because you, you saw both of those 1v1 gunfights. If you turn that into a 2v1, you get that trade-off. It becomes worth. The chances of you getting two-piece, very, very low. So by staying together, you just increase your chances of survivability. Coach Benson dropping the knowledge, ladies and gents.
Jägermeister here top pawn, and already they did have Wicked Shrapnel sneak behind enemy lines. Shots going down in the middle. He can clean this up. Does not know there's a player right behind him, so smart move to dip out, and he will run right into the bullets of Gumby. Gumby loves that spot right outside the strip club. Meanwhile, sh battle oh, up top. Jaeger no. turning and burning on Chaotic. Oh, my God. That's going on YouTube. Woohoo! That was disgusting. Jaeger now at four and three. Ronnie Ron, though, gets your round ending kill cam with the two piece. Solid right. stuff, boys. That's, that's what they need. Now they can try and build on this confidence that this round's going to give them because they were looking very much down and out, a bit dejected that maybe they weren't able to capitalize on the opposition only having three people. But, I mean, that was a, a ridiculous turn on up top and a nice two piece in, the, in that kill cam now. They need to win this attacking round. You win the attacking round, confidence goes through the roof. Are they going to try and change things up? That's what I really want to see from them. You can see Wicked Shrapnel immediately rushing that A site. Now, this is a lot better, but he's by himself. He's isolated again. He needs some support because if the bomb carry goes down in a horrible position, I mean, how are you going to retrieve that? Three people have stayed at Strip. That is not good. If yeah. he drops that bomb, I mean, if, if he dies now, which it's looking like he may do, right now they know bomb is down. That's oh. just, and, and you've got players all scattered around the, the map. You, you can't do that, especially against a, a team like Termination. They will just punish you every single time. Right now, I'm punishing myself. I wanted to stay on board with Redneck this whole time to see if he'd get a snipe. I've missed all of the action. <laughs> 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 and, and he's doing what he thinks is right by watching the cross. He just, you know, got to that position a little bit late, missed the first round of guys, and then didn't follow through with Wicked Shrapnel after not seeing anything, and that is going to cost this team the round. 3-1 is about to become 4-1 for Termination. Jägermeister, the last man standing. Again, though, even though one player went down at A, you've just seen the remaining three players from, from the Pounders rush at that bomb by themselves. And again, that isn't something you want to do. You want to try and get yourselves in a position where as a team you can try and make some plays happen. Because Jägermeister left in that one versus three. He's having a great game, six and four. But, you know, you're going up against Chaotic 6-1, and one, Gumby 6-4, and four, and Explicit 4-2. and two. It's a very, very tough to try and, uh, Sorry, a very, very tough feat to try and do. You know, and you can see that so far for the Pounders that they have just fought their way here based on pure skill. Jägermeister showing his shot so far in this game. Had a great kill on the player coming out of the gas. Very fast reactions. Almost got that final kill if it wasn't for the player coming behind him after challenging while injured. So... They're not making the smartest plays, but they have the gun skill, and Jaeger there picks up the long shot to get first blood on Conquer. I've actually been tweeted a very interesting fact, Bucket. I think, I think you'll like this. Uh, this is from Dalton Favor. He said, fun fact for you, Ben. Term didn't compete in the first OQ because one of their players fell asleep. Fell asleep? Yeah. What? <laughs> That's why they didn't compete in the first online qualifier, apparently. Oh one of their my... players was too busy having a siesta, having a snooze. Man, as long as it's not a fiesta party, it's all good in my book. All right, Jaeger picks up the final kill, and now it's time for the defuse. Good work, boys. Here we go. We got a tight search and destroy game, bringing it back within two rounds. Yeah, nicely done, nicely done. But again, we need I to just calm down on those small mistakes. Because if you look at this game as a whole, those, those small mistakes they've had, it would have put them in the lead. You know, Termination wouldn't have the 4-2 the advantage going going into the remaining time of the, of the search and destroy. So if they can calm down on those small errors, they do have a good chance of winning the search. I'm just told in a tweet as well that final boss has advanced to most likely play against fear. So good luck That's to those boys in the round six battle. Unfortunately, we are unable to join them from the studio just due to some Xbox connection issues. So we will not be able to bring you that match. We apologize in advance, but best of luck to both squads. Would love to have either of them at the U.S. Championship. Yeah, both those teams, very, very high-quality players on both. And back in, in this game, you've got Jägermeister and Ronnie Ron left in a two versus four, make that Ronnie Ron all by himself and bomb down in not the best of positions. So how's he going to try and play it? He needs to pick up a kill if he can. This play is all of around him, so that shouldn't be too difficult. It looks like there's actually two players above him. peek a oh, Yeah. How are you doing, buddy? One more yeah. top. Can he Aww. find the kill? No, not going to happen. And unfortunately, that is now going to put it to 5-2. To I'm totally not biased here, Ben. I totally, uh, you, totally don't want uh, Pounders to win this. No. Uh -uh. And then maybe win the next one. No, that would be, that'd be a terrible, terrible thing, wouldn't it? As a caster, totally not allowed to cheer for these guys. <laughs> 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 Come on, Redneck. Let's do it, baby. I know he's got it in him. I, 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 got, I, got, I got a call. I know they got it in him. I just... 
I just don't think they got this map. That's the issue right now. Yeah. Yeah, I think, I think it, again, it's just those small mistakes. And it, it depends if they decide to carry on playing, you know, playing some, some major tournaments. Obviously, the uh, MLG Championship comes up after Cod Champs. So it'd be great to see them there, and that gives them some time to, to really practice. But it is those small, small mistakes that we're seeing, which are really just costing them rounds. And against a great Search and Destroy team, if you drop one round, if, you, if you're gifting them free rounds, you're not going to win the game. It's as simple as that. Shrapnel almost picked up a kill bottom strip. It is a three on two now. Chaotic, explicit, conquer, left alive for term. Here's the two on two if Shrapnel can hit the shots. And man, this guy, if he had a Remington so far in this game, would have two kills, possibly a third to his name. Shrapnel and Jaeger left alive. What can they do about the three remaining players? Yeah, this, is, this is a very, very tough position as Shrapnel's going to get knifed again. Body shooting going down. Jaeger... One versus two. We're going up against the Chaotic in the form of an 11 and two slaying prowess. That is huge. He's going to get charged, and Chaotic picks up the kill. 12 and two. Rounds that up nicely. Really, really well played by the Termination guys, and they are just one map away from getting to that round number six. Man, Chaotic is a freak on this map. Search and destroy Octane. <laughs> he is so good. We Very saw good. what he did in round number three, and he just went off, even though we had to switch sides. He's going to close out this game 12 Two, two plants, 920 points at top of the leaderboard. Jaegermeister, shout out to John Jaeger, dropping nine and six against a very, very talented termination squad. That is going to be two in the books for term. They just need to win. Blue